Former President Donald Trump returning to court Thursday. It's the third week of his New York City criminal trial. Before the jury heard any testimony, Trump faced the prospect of additional sanctions for violating the gag order Judge Juan Marchand imposed on him. They have no case. They have no case. But we have a very uh, conflicted judge, unfortunately. The judge has already fined Trump $9,000 Tuesday for violating the rule prohibiting him from speaking publicly about witnesses or jurors in the case. Rochon went on to warn Trump the former president could also face jail time if he continues to ignore the order. Also, we can't talk about this leading prosecutor who came from the Biden administration. Back on the stand, Beverly Hills lawyer Keith Davidson, the attorney who represented both Playboy model Kara McDougal and adult film star Stormy Daniels in their deals. On Tuesday, Davidson testified he negotiated the $280,000 paid to both McDougal and Daniels to hide their alleged affairs with Trump. While Davidson said he did not speak to Trump directly, he did testify that he believed the deal would benefit Trump's election efforts in 2016. At a rally yesterday in Wisconsin, the former president again blasted the trial. He's a totally conflicted judge. And I come, you know, it's, it's, it's unfortunately, it's a 95 percent or so Democrat area. Other than that, things are wonderful. Every morning when the former president shows up here at court, he attacks the case. This morning, he called it a show trial. But prosecutors say they have a strong case. At Manhattan Criminal Court, Eric Sean, Fox News.